today I was at the Black Lion store. I love that store. I don't know if you guys have a Black Lion store in your area, but we certainly do here in North Carolina. So today this video is just to share with you a little snippet of what I found in my local Black Lion. You guys stay tuned and I'll be right back with you. So I'm back. Well, this is not going to be a very long video. I just thought this was the cutest dog on idea. So you know I'm gonna snatch it. <laughs> I'm gonna do the same thing. Well, I, actually, I saw this idea in a magazine, and uh, they were using it. Uh, um, they were um, using it to decorate uh, an outdoor event. Well, what I'm talking about is this little item here. Look at this. Can you can you see that? Look at that. You see that? It's a mason mason jar on a glass candle holder. They call this the redneck goblet. The redneck goblet. Let me tell you what it says. It says redneck goblet. Enjoy iced tea, lemonade, or your favorite drink in true southern style. Even uh, even includes a to go lid for uh, best care please, um, please hand wash is what it said well this I thought was a good idea but I saw it before I never thought of it as a drinking item but sure enough uh, whoever did it you know decided to make it into a goblet now I think this is cute I don't know about you but I thought this was the cutest idea now y'all know that I'm in the South and I'm just as Southern as I want to be and you know a Southern not one Southerner that I know does not have a mason jar so I've got goo gobs of mason jars I've got the big 36 ounce 16 ounce mason jars the 8 ounce jars the small one as a matter of fact here's a mason jar right here it's a jelly mason jar jelly jar so I have them and look Mason jars. I got all kinds. Could you imagine? So when I saw that, you know, I got excited. I said, oh, God, I know what I'm going to do. So I'm going to take this container and I am not going to, first of all, I'm not going to drink out of it. I don't want to. Uh, what I'm going to do with this container is turn it into um, a centerpiece, a, can, a display. And I'm going to um, buy some of my own because, you know, this costs some money for one dollar. This is from the dollar store. Don't start. This came from the dollar store and you can buy a pack of mason jars for like twelve dollars. This whole thing right here was twelve ninety five. Yes it was. Uh huh. So I said okay they got me one time but they won't get me again. So I'm going to go buy me some these dollar um these dollar candle holders from from the well the candles from the dollar store and make my own. Now when I looked at it, of course you know I'm Susie Do It Yourself. So oh that's a cute little name. Not Susie. Sophie Do It Yourself. So I'm Sophie Do It Yourself and I see here that it is sealed with silicone. It's glued but it's sealed with silicone so it won't it won't come off. And of course it's clear so you can hardly see it. So I'm going to do the same thing with my big ones because I, I want the big tall, the tall one um, that I have and my shorter ones and I'm going to do a three piece uh, centerpiece, uh, three piece, yeah, the tall one, this size and then the smaller one that I have and I'm going to fill it with candles. Well now, you know what, well, I, I have, I'm vacillating between using sand and putting a candle in it which is what is expected. I don't want to use marbles. I've used rocks before and I use little pebbles. All those are cute so I'm thinking that I may do something different like my bathroom is a blue, it's, it's really pretty blue but I have accessories in there that uh, is uh, olive, you know, olive colors. I think I'm going to do, I'm going to go to the grocery store and buy some split pea, dried split pea soup. They come in the bag and I'm going to fill uh, maybe halfway to, well, you know, here, not halfway, a little more than halfway, here with split pea soup and maybe rice because that's green and white. Split pea soup and rice or maybe just do rice and 
put my candle in here and display it in my bathroom on my counter. Oh, that'd be so cute. So I just wanted to share with you guys what I got from Black Lion and then the ideas that popped out of my head. Now I'm gonna tell you, you I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna tell you what you can do. You can do all kinds of things with it. You can take the top, you can paint the top, you can uh, bead the top. Um, another idea, and when I was uh, on my way home, I was just was so excited. I think I have a whole bunch, a whole bunch goo gobs, as I said before of pearls all kinds of pearls because I was making jewelry and then I had I was sewing pearls on things so I have a bunch of pearls and I think I may put pearls in here as well so I'm just gonna work my little idea out but I just wanted to share that idea with you you guys can make this this is a D I Y craft you can do it yourself candle holder redneck wine goblet or whatever tea iced tea whatever you want to call it but this is a really cute idea so I'm going to snatch it and I'm going to change it to fit what I want thank you guys for watching my channel thank you guys so much for being so supportive you can find me on Facebook at Grandma Bubbles Beauty Basics or you can just find me on Twitter and I'll put the link in the bottom of the display box uh, is it display box? Description box. That's where I'm going to put it. Right down there. You guys have a good day. Bye-bye.